To calculate impulse using a force time graph, we can find the area under the graph. So, we can get force multiplied by time and hence we have the impulse. Here, let us take an example. The graph below shows the force which acts on a 7 kg object over a time interval of 8 seconds. So, we have constant force of 4 Newton acting for the initial 4 seconds and then it increases uniformly to 10 Newton over the remaining 4 seconds. We have to find impulse change in momentum and the final velocity of the object if the initial speed is 6 meter per second. So, from the graph we can divide it into two sections, the bottom rectangle and the top triangle. Area of the rectangle 4 times 8, 32. Area of the triangle half base times height. So, here 8 minus 4, 4 and here 10 minus 4, 6. So, that will be 12. To find the total impulse, we add the area together. So, 32 plus 12 that is 44. Hence, the first answer impulse 44 Newton second. Change in momentum is the same as impulse, so 44 kg meter per second. And to find the final velocity, we can use the expression for change in momentum is m v minus u. With the values, change in momentum 44, mass 7, initial velocity 6. Open the bracket, rearrange, simplify, we get speed as 12.29 meter per second. For more Problems on force time graph and their solutions. Follow me on Solutions by Tall Teacher on Instagram. Like, comment, share, and subscribe to my channel. Stay tuned for updates.